Hi guys, Matilda here. I'm at TT Liquor Mixology's flagship venue in Shoreditch. Today we're going to show you how to make a non-alcoholic pineapple picante smash, one of the drinks created for our cocktail making classes. We've swapped out the tequila for seed lip spice, which really complements the pineapple and chili flavors in the drink. This one packs a punch. The ingredients are in the description below, and here's Kay to show you how to make it. Hi guys, it's Kay back here at TT Liquor. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to make an alcohol-free version of our pineapple picante smash. So this is a really nice built drink. Uh, usually we'd use tequila, but obviously this one is gonna be alcohol-free. Uh, as it's a built drink, I'm gonna be making it in the same glass I'm serving it in, which is this lovely little julep tin. Now, first things going into my julep tin are gonna be some fresh fruit. Uh, first of those, are gonna be some pineapple chunks. I've got some here that I've cut already. If you were making this at home, you could absolutely just use tin pineapple chunks as well. Now I want maybe about four or five of these pineapple chunks in the bottom of my glass. So I'm gonna grab a chili. I'm just gonna roll it between my hands to loosen up the seeds a little bit so that when I cut the top off, I can just give it a little shake over the bin and get rid of all of those. Now we don't want this too hot, so I'm just gonna do Two little slices of my chili in there. Beautiful, got a lime here. I'm just gonna cut it down into little quarter wedges and I'll pop one of those in there. But I'm gonna grab my muddler and use that to give them all a good squish. So I'll cover the top with my hand to stop anything flying out. Get the muddler in there, break the chili up a little bit and get it mixed around with those other things. Now this is a non-alcoholic version of this cocktail. So in place of the usual tequila, we've got this lovely seed lip spice. We want 50 mils of our seed lip. There we go. Right, next thing going in here for some extra pineapple flavor is gonna be some pineapple juice. I'll give this a little shake before I open it. And I want the same amount of pineapple as I had of my seed lip, so 50 mils again. Perfect. Now the final ingredient going into this cocktail, just to give us a little bit of sweetness, is gonna be some sugar syrup. Um, we don't need too much of this, I just want 20 mils of my sugar syrup. There we go. The last thing to add to this is some crushed ice. Now I'm not gonna fill the cup all the way up, I'm gonna leave a little bit of space at the top so I've got room to stir my cocktail. I'm gonna grab my bar spoon, cover the top of the cup with my hand again to stop anything flying out, get the spoon in there and give this a real good mix. So I've given that a stir for about 10 seconds. A lot of that crushed ice has melted down, diluted the cocktail and lengthened it out. To finish this off, I'm gonna give it a nice crown of crushed ice. I'm gonna take a big old scoop of crushed ice, pile it on top of the drink and just use my hand to form it into a dome. That's gonna act as an insulator, stop the ice that's underneath from melting any further and making our drink any more watery than it already is. Now for a garnish, I've got a pineapple leaf. I'll just pop that in there on the edge. And finally, this is in this cold metal tin. It's not gonna be the most comfortable thing to hold on to. So to make it a little bit more pleasant, I'm gonna give them a little jacket. I'm gonna take one of my bar napkins just fold it in half along the diagonal to make a triangle. And then I'll take each of these two outer corners, dip them in a little bit of water so that the wet corners stick to the outside of that cold metal tin and give him a little cape. So there we have it. That is our alcohol-free pineapple picante smash ready to drink.